Hi, my name is Val Malbert, and I think sound and music play a crucial part in films. You have now published your animation on YouTube, and that's great, but how about adding some music to it? I'm going to show you the iMovie app, the king of movie editing software for iPads and iPhones. To start, tap the iMovie app. The very first thing you'll see is a view of your film projects, if you have any. To start another project, tap the plus in the upper right corner. You can now choose to create a trailer or a movie. The trailer feature is fantastic and completely self-instructed. You really must try to make a trailer, but for this project choose movie. You now have the option to select a theme. Themes combine certain music, title styles and transition effects. I'll talk more about that later. For now we can go with any theme. I just tap create movie. On the bottom we have the timeline. This is the working space. To the upper right you can find the material for your movie. iMovie connects with your camera roll so all videos saved to your camera roll are available from here. You can of course use photos as well as video clips and if you'd like mix stills with motion capture. Here we also have audio which can be added to the project. Theme music and sound effects are built in sounds which comes with the app. If you've bought music on iTunes or have transferred music via iTunes on your computer, you can add this music to your project. Just keep in mind that you must not use copyrighted music in a movie that you publish on the internet or share with other people. The theme music and sound effects are already free though. Now let's get to business. I tap video. Your animation should be found here since you saved it to your camera roll. Here is my very short animation. I tap it. And now I have some options. I can watch the video by tapping here or put it down onto the timeline, tapping the banded arrow. Tapping the dots will reveal even more and advanced options, but I'll skip the advanced stuff and just put the clip on the timeline. Here we go. I can now move the clip and watch it from various start positions. Trimming is easy, I just tap the clip and I can trim it by moving the yellow handles. But let's undo using the undo feature. Before adding the music I'd like some title text. My film features a robot, so that will also be the name of my film. I tap title and I choose opening. This means my title will be shown in the beginning of the clip. But because my story is so short, the text interferes with the film. So in this case I'd like to add a clip just before the title. This can be achieved in many ways. One way is to add a photo to the timeline and apply the title to the photo. Another way is to freeze a suitable frame in the clip. This one should do. And now I tap freeze. To move the frozen frame, I touch it for some time and I adjust the position in the timeline. Now I can add a title to the start frame. But if you just want the title background to be black, there is even another trick. Let's undo some actions. Right. Now I tap the camera icon. It's black because I covered the lens. I swipe to select photo and I tap the photo button. Yes, I want to use this photo and now my beautiful black background is added to the timeline. I trim it and I finally add the title. The style of the title depends on which movie theme I choose in the beginning, but there are many styles to choose from if you're disappointed with the default style. I tap the text icon and I think I'm going to go with this one. Perfect. I also want to have closing credits with the same style applied, so I simply duplicate the title clip. Let's adjust the text as well. Now music please. I tap audio and theme music. 
you can listen to the various music clips by tapping them and then tap play. I think I'm gonna go with this one. So I tap the arrow and now I have music. I tap the music clip for further options. Here I can adjust the volume. I can also add fade effects to the audio clip, which is great. Now my music will fade out smoothly instead of just stopping. Now I'm very satisfied with the film. I tap here and now I can name my project. I can also share my film. I tap the share icon and I choose YouTube. And after filling the necessary fields I tap share. So this is what I want you to do. Add title and music to your animation using iMovie. Publish the new film on YouTube and send me the YouTube link for assessments. Good luck!